Welcome back to the show that is extremely depressing but also makes you feel bad for not watching it. It's the 5 o'clock news. Hi, I'm Leanne Jones, but it's not like you'll remember my name anyway. <laughs> Today, we will be talking about war, politics, more war, and dying animals. <laughs> Hello, I'm her male counterpart with the extremely dull name who's desperately trying not to be distracted by her gaudy dress. <clears throat> First off, David Cameron decides to show support for his favourite football club, West Ham. <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry, my mistake. I mean Aston Villa. Of course it's Aston. Definitely Aston. Also this week, the new James Bond has finally been revealed. Many objected to this casting, but the producer stated that this was essential for the change of image that James Bond needed. <gasps> this is just in! Kim Jong-un surprises his citizens with a late New Year fireworks display! Isn't that lovely? <laughs> well, the weather in Cornwall is interesting to Tracy in Cornwall. It's really raining. Thanks, Tracy. Now we go on to our celebrity news with Stacy. To you, Stacy. Hi, and today on Celebrity News, we have two billionaires marrying with an age gap that would give anyone a heart attack. In other news, Kim K has finally had another forgotten child, which she has called Pope West. Back to you. Thank you, Becky. That's not my name. We don't get paid to know your name, Stella. Culture. Culture. Well, that's all we have time for today.